The Arcadia 2001 is a second-generation 8-bit home video game console released by Emerson Radio in May 1982 for a price of $99, US several months before the release of Coleco Vision. It was discontinued only 18 months later, with a total of 35 games having been released. Emerson licensed the Arcadia 2001 to Bandai, which released it in Japan. Over 30 Arcadia 2001 clones exist. The unrelated Arcadia Corporation, manufacturer of the Atari 2600 supercharger add-on, was sued by Emerson for trademark infringement. Arcadia Corporation then changed its name to Starpath. The Arcadia is much smaller than its contemporary competitors and is powered by a standard 12-volt power supply so it can be used in a boat or a vehicle. It also has two outputs headphone jacks on the back of the unit, on the far left and far right sides. The system came with two Intellivision-style controllers with a 12-button keypad and fire buttons on the sides. The direction pads have a removable joystick attachment. Most games came with bow pet overlays that could be applied to the controller's keypads. The console itself had five buttons, power, start, reset, option, and select. There are at least three different types of cartridge case styles and artwork, with variations on each. Emerson family cartridges come in two different lengths of black plastic cases. Arcadia 2001 motherboard Many variants and clones of the Arcadia 2001 have been released by various companies in different countries. These systems are mostly compatible with each other. In 1982, the Bondi Arcadia was released only in Japan. Four exclusive games were released for the system. In 1982, the Bondi Arcadia, a variant of the Emerson Arcadia 2001, was licensed and distributed to Japan by Bandai for a price of 19,800 yen. There were four Japan exclusive games released by Bandai. The Emerson booth at CES 1982, featuring their Arcadia 2001 system. After seeing the Arcadia 2001 at the Summer 1982 Consumer Electronics Show, Danny Goodman of Creative Computing Video and Arcade Games reported that its graphics were similar to the Atari 2600s and that our overall impression of the gameplay was favorable for a system in this price range, though no cartridge stands out as being an exciting original creation. He called the controller offering both in television-like disc and joystick functionality a great idea. Emerson planned to launch the console with 19 games. Some Arcadia 2001 games are ports of lesser-known arcade games such as Route 16, Jungler, and Jumpbug, which were not available on other home systems. Emerson actually created many popular arcade titles including Pac-Man, Galaxian and Defender for the Arcadia, but never had them manufactured as Atari started to sue its competitor companies for releasing games to which it had exclusive rights agreements. Early marketing showed popular arcade games, but they were later released as clones. For instance, the Arcadia 2001 game Space Raiders is a clone of Defender, and Breakaway is a clone of Breakout. There are 47 games known to have been released for the Arcadia 2001 and its clones. Thanks for watching.